Hello guys, welcome back to Civil Engineering YouTube channel. Please subscribe our channel for daily civil engineering videos. In today's lecture, we are going to discuss some of the basic solve mechanics formulas. So, with the help of these formulas, you can solve almost your 90% solve mechanics problems. So, starting from the first formula, which is a very basic formula. The first one is the relation between the wide ratio and the porosity n is equal to 1 minus n where e is the have wide ratio and n is the porosity of the soil this formula is mostly used when wide when you have to find the wide ratio or in the porosity is given to us and the second relation is n is equal to the e divided by 1 plus e in this case, if the wide ratio is known to us, and you have to find out the porosity. So, these two are the basic formulas. The third formula is that the degree of saturation into wide ratio is equal to the water content into the specific gravity. Here in this case, this is the degree of saturation. Degree of saturation. E is the wide ratio, W is the water content, and G is, is the specific gravity of the soil. So this formula is also used to find out the unknowns in one of the basic formulas in the soil mechanics where you can solve most of the problems with this formula. So if you if you want to find the degree of situation of the soil, just shift this y ratio into the right side and so on so you can use this formula in order to find your unknown parameter the fourth formula is the about the bulk unit weight which is equal to the gamma b equal to the g plus s e into gamma w divided by 1 plus e now this is the to find out the gamma bulk the bulk unit weight of the soil so gamma b is equal to the g where g is the specific gravity s is the degree of saturation e is the wide ratio gamma w is the unit weight of water where unit weight of water water is fixed 9.81 kilonewton per cubic meter you should remember this value and 1 plus e here is 1 is a constant and e is the wide ratio so by putting this value you can find out the bulk unit weight of the soil now we can use this formula to find out the other unit weights for example the fifth formula derived from this one did the gamma saturated gamma saturated gamma saturation saturation means that the degree of saturation in this case is, will be equal to the one so here if we put one here in this formula so it will become g plus s in place of the s i want to put one one into E into gamma W divided by 1 plus E. So I just put here degree of saturation equal to 1 because it is 100% in case of the saturation this degree of saturation is 100% so I just put here the value of 1 so here we got the formula from the bulk unit weight to saturated unit weight of the soil. Similarly if you want to find out the dry unit weight so in case of the dry unit weight, your S will be equal to 0. So in this case, if I put here S is equal to 0 here in this formula, so our bulk unit weight will be changed to the dry unit weight. So it will be comes out to be G. If I put here 0, so it means this whole equation becomes equal to 0. So G plus 0 into gamma W divided by 1 plus E. Or we can say gamma dry equal to G S into gamma w divided by 1 plus e so this is our sixth formula so what i did here i put the degree of saturation equal to zero because in the dry unit weight there is no saturation the last formula in the basic one is the the relation between the dry unit weight and the bulk unit weight where gamma d is equal to gamma b and 1 plus w here you can find out the dry unit weight by this formula 
where gamma b is the bulk unit weight w is the water content and you can find out the gamma d or the dry unit weight similarly if gamma d is known to us you can find out your gamma b from this formula by changing gamma b will be equal to the gamma d into 1 plus w you can also find your gamma b bulk unit weight from this formula so hope you guys understand and remember these formulas because these are the formulas where you can solve your 90 percent soil mechanics problems with these formulas hope you understand and don't forget to subscribe our channel for daily seven engineering videos thank you for watching our video